Hello there, welcome to the AS Maths Pure June 2023 paper here on question one, a differentiation question. The curve has this equation and we need to write down dy by dx, writing your answer in simplest form. Okay, so we need to differentiate this, so that means we need to write dy by dx at the start, and then the power is going to multiply the number at the front, so 2 thirds times 3 gives us 2, and then you reduce the power by 1. Uh, 2 multiplies by this minus 7 over 2, so that becomes minus 7x. Uh, when it's a 4x, the differential of that is just 4, and then when it's just a number, that number disappears. So there we are, that's the answer to this question here. Part B, hence write down the range of values of x for which y is decreasing. And if y is decreasing, then that means that dy by dx is less than 0. Uh, so we're going to start off by writing 2x squared minus 7x minus 4 is less than 0. If the question were increasing, then you would put that inequality the other way around. So now we need to solve this. So I'm going to start off by factorising. Um, I need to put the minus 4 on this side, plus 1 here. So I get two solutions of x equals minus a half and x equals 4. What does this uh, quadratic look like graphically? Well, I'll have two intercepts, one at minus a half and one at 4, and it will be a positive x squared graph like this. So what we want to find now is the region for which the this quadratic, this differential, is less than 0, which would be in this region here between minus a half and four. So therefore our final answer for this question is minus a half to x to four. So um, x values in between minus a half and four. So there we are, that's the answer for question one. Let's now move on to question two.